Mortise and tenon joints are perhaps the strongest way to connect two pieces of wood together. If you want to build furniture that will last, you have to know how to make a square hole for the mortise half of the joint. And perhaps the simplest way to make a square hole is with a round Forstner bit. Let's imagine I want to connect this piece to this one at a 90 degree angle. I'll use a pencil to mark the width of my connecting workpiece on the edge of the opposite one. A quick way to find the center of this is to angle my rule so that I have an inch mark on each edge, which positions the two inch mark at the exact center. Here's another trick that will really help you bore your holes accurately. I'm using an awl to create a shallow groove over my center line. Now the tip of the Forstner bit can slip into that groove and I can drill a series of holes perfectly in line with each other. I start with a hole at each end in the mortise area. Then I add overlapping holes to remove the remaining waste in between. As long as the point of the bit finds a place in the wood, the rest of the bit doesn't have to be fully engaged to bore a straight hole. With the bulk of the waste bored out, I can use a chisel to clean up the small amount of remaining waste and finish my square. Now you have a perfectly formed mortise, but what about the other half of the joint, the tenon? Tap on the video link at the bottom of the screen to see how I cut those.